let me try that so this is technically a new uh, project now so 34 times 5 it's just the same avatar and if this also um, is screwy now then I can always go and um, and uh, start a brand new project I like this leaving the patterns on top of one another it just saves me a little bit more time I mean it would save me even more time if I just use arrangement points that is also a, a good argument but you know I'm just not mentally just not at that point yet like that whoop that is uh, let's try that again from here's to theirs perfect and then from here to there uh well almost i say from here to there ha perfect so old measurements technically new project no worry steve thank you for dropping by always good to see you merry christmas and look at that so this is with a fresh project it works so <laughs> crazy i'm gonna make my zipfel rock thing again and that was what was that 80 it was wasn't it it was about um uh, let's make it yes 50 by 50 and then we're gonna well, 50 by 80 i think we had it Technically 25 by 80. Let's do that, and then um, and then at the bottom here, I'll make it 50, or something, uh, you know, something longer. Or no, even better, I'm going to use Christina's amazing tip here, and use no, actually, I don't have to, which I have used earlier, Christina. Um, how did I do that again? Was that was that that? I think so. And then we go and say distance moved uh, 25. I might make it, it uh, slightly wider. On the bottom i'll make it 40 on the bottom what 30 well, i'll make it exactly like before 25. yeah you see no i think i'm going to use your your um trick just because it's easier so it's going to be the uh, the transform point segment trick selecting both these points double clicking the thing in the middle and then just moving this and then both points spread equally on the um, on the outside and now I'm gonna say let maybe let me get make it 60 here yeah I feel better about that don't ask me why change line like yeah that um, I suppose uh, that was my first idea to do that change line length and yes that's right that's what i was looking for oh that's cool that's that's great and then i can go use both and then it'll also do that good point i like both options do that Which one is the front? Is this the front? This this is the front. So that that should go here, and then that can go kind of here to the back. So these two pieces are also the front. Go sew so these together. This guy here, they need to be split uniformly twice. This one and that one. And then I think this can go here. Is that right? Ish. Yes. And then that can go here. That's that's kind of cool. Oops. It's it's a little it's a little heavy. That's cool. <laughs> I like it much better geometrically now. Can I, can I duplicate both pieces 
with sewing is that possible symmetric pattern with sewing is that can i do that yeah maybe not maybe i'll just use copy and paste i'm scared by the blue line now i, I don't know what i did there that's um Right, I think I copied, no, did I, did I copy something? I can't tell. <laughs> it's all screwed up. I don't know what I did there. Can I? Um, so just selecting both patterns then. Symmetric pattern with sewing. Uh, how do I duplicate it then? Just, just copy and paste now, I suppose. copy and paste like this do we do that i think we might and then It's my special version again, Christina. Unbelievable. Is it Control G that did that? Oh, it does it only the, for one pattern. Okay, good. No worries. No worries. <laughs> That's terrible. The opposite of what I wanted. Okay, no worries. Um, see how calm I remain under pressure? I'll just use it manually. I don't even worry. I don't even, you know. I'm not even thinking, hey, this should work. I'm just thinking, hey, it, it always does what it wants. There we go. <laughs> so all we need to do now is fix the sewing lines to the top here, maybe. From here to there. Does that, does that, yes, that's correct. And then from here to there. These things are already sewn together. All we need to do is put that to here. And that is sewn on both sides. All right. <laughs> oh, it arrived. How exciting, Dream Lab. That is exciting. How many buttons does that have? That's like, is it like, uh, mine has got three by five and yours got, it's gotta be like, it's gotta be like amazing. <laughs> 32, right, right, cool three by five so how many more is that then three by there's that got it's got four four lines four by eight then that's that's probably what it is right four by eight yes woohoo awesome that is good a pound excellent Jerry can use them both you can if you still have your small one you can literally use them both so many exciting things that you can do with the stream deck i have in addition to this i have the ios app the this it's an annual subscription 25 a year i think and you can use it on as many ios devices as you like and it's really nice so when i'm here in studio c i have this and then when i'm at my main desk i can use my iphone or my ipad and that is very cool and you can use them side by side and copy things between stream decks it's very very nice You know, it behaves completely different at the top, uh, Christina, by the way, than the old version did. The old version had just more fabric. It had way more folds at the very top. I don't really know what it is or how to describe it, but this is just, this is, you know, much closer to what I was looking for here. I wonder if I can combine these two into uh, into one project then, because I'd like to see them both on the, on the same avatar. Let me go and uh, save this first as a standalone project. And I'll call this one here Zipfelrock. I think that's a good word. I don't even know what, what we should, what, what that is in English, Zipfelrock. But you know, it's, it's nice, we'll, we'll do that. Zipfelrock, version one. Tail skirt, all oh, right, okay. Nice, thank you. Ready, so if I'm gonna try to add 
a garment now. Is that how it works? Add garment from another project? That's garment. Mine's in marvelous projects. Puffy shirt two. Puffy shirt two Vita. No, that's not how it works. No project. Okay. So file open project. Puffy shirt V2. Actually V2, Puffy shirt 2 version 2, that's the one. And then I can say add something indeed, just the garment, not the avatar. And I say that's probably in centimeters. And I say boom. All right, let's see what happens. And there it is. Oh my. And that was hidden, so I just need to make it unhidden. Clone internal freeze rotate. Show. Boom. Goody, and I think it's also frozen, so I need to unfreeze that as well. Unfreeze. Yep, there we go. And now we just need to, maybe I'll just need to go and, and freeze this here for a second. Uh, freeze. Perfect, just so that I can, I can pull this out. As two worlds collide, the broken version and the working version. So I could probably strengthen the bottom part here. That might that might work whoops isn't that frozen as well i thought i just froze that i guess i didn't do that there i might make it shorter but then that's how that's what it looks like together tail skirt and the puffy shirt not bad. Let's go and unfreeze that. <laughs> Not bad, huh? For something I didn't know if I could if I could do all this from scratch. Yeah, I'm I'm very pleased. Let's look at it in the in the pretty viewport. I'm very pleased about it. And this I think is now a particle distance 10 already. Right, gotcha. Groovy! <laughs> 